let's go, let's go, let's go, come here, come here. Hey guys, today um, I will show you how to train, or at least how I train my dogs. Um, so yeah, right now I have two dogs. I have um, a three month old Pomeranian. Her name is Yona. She's just new. I just had her for two weeks and she's quite playful. Um, she's handful, but she's lovely and sweet and smart. And then, oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry. And then I have here Sven. He's a poodle. He's supposed to be a toy poodle, but he it turned out to be a miniature poodle when he grew up. Um, but he still, that's fine. And I love him to bits. Right? Um, so today we'll uh, I'll show you how I train my dogs, or at least how I train Sven, and how I will be training you when I'm moving forward. So in order for you to train a dog, you will, of course, have to have traits. Um, you need to have traits, and you have to choose your traits. For older dogs, like Sven here, he's already one and a half year old, years old. Um, he can't pretty much uh, have any treat because it, his digestive system is not too sensitive. So he can just have pretty much any treat um, that I give him. Whereas for Yona, she's still a baby, right? Three months old. It has to be safe, at least uh, natural, or at least natural, basically. Um, so you can either have uh, chicken, uh, boiled chicken, and then cut it into small pieces. Or for, for in my case for now, I just uh, give her um, hard boiled egg. Because I, I noticed that hard boiled egg doesn't have any um, negative effect into her digestive system. And I've, I've observed like before I gave her, before I used hard boiled egg as a treat for her, I just like tried to give her a few uh, bits, uh, small pieces, um, just to make sure, and then check her poop afterwards, just to make sure that um, it does not have any bad effect on her. And so far, her poop is just uh, in good shape, and it's still, um, yeah, it, it looks okay. Okay, so now let me show you what Sven can do. He already gave me a sip. So, um, basically, to train a dog, you'll have to establish a currency that's very, pretty important so you have to let them know that you're the one who's uh, you're the one who's in charge and you and that they will get they will get the treat if they do what you tell them to all right so Sven, he's already do, showing me some tricks let me just uh, let's just go uh let's just have a quick run through of what Sven can do all right Sven, come on um can you? No, 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 not just yet. Sit. Down. Good boy. No, 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 no. Down. Ah! Play dead. Yes, good job. Now stand. Walk. 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 Yes, good job. So there, are, sir, uh, there are different parts on uh, training your dog. So first is you say the command. Like if I say, Sven, Sven. Uh, well, you have to make sure that he has his, you, you have his full attention first, like this. So let's establish the down command. All right, down, and then you let them, and then you wait for them to actually do what you want them to do. And then once you see that they have done exactly what you want them to do, you um, need to, you have to say like a marker, either a yes or a tick. You can, I, you can even have some clicker if you want to, just to mark them uh, or just to let them know that that's what exactly you wanted them to do and they have already done that. And once they hear that sound, it is time for treat. Okay, so let's just do that. Sven, sit down. Yes, good boy. Play dead. Yes, good boy. So you see, every time he does what I tell him to do, I say yes. And that signifies that he's, a, he's accomplished what I'm asking him to do, and he will get the treat. Um, here's another trick I taught Sven, which is pretty important for any uh, new dog. It's like um, something, it's, it's like a must because it will come really handy 
at different situations, in many situations. All right, spin, stay. Okay, come. Good job. So this time around, we're gonna let Yona out and teach her some tricks. Hopefully she does learn something. Your turn, baby Yona. Baby Yona. Are we recording though? Oh, we are. Okay. Baby Yona. Baby Yona. Um, I think Yonan already knows how to sit, but let me just show you. <laughs> there already she sat. Um, Yona? 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 And sometimes you have to make your voice really exciting, so maybe just have that high, high pitch tone. Because um, it makes the dog feel more uh, enticed, or it, it makes the training more lively. Yona, come on, sit. Yes! Good girl! Good girl! <laughs> oh, he just made a lot of mess there. Yeah, yeah! Good girl! Eat those. Yona! Um, the trick about sit is actually... Um, so you hold the treat and then you try to lure them into the position where you want them to be in. Um, and then uh, once, they, once their butt already touches the ground, you say your marker, which is yes, and then you give the treat. Okay, come here, come here, Yona, come here. All right, once again, no, no, Sven. <laughs> Sven, come on, come on. You're already done, now it's Yona's turn. Come here, Yona, sit, <laughs> sit. Yes, good girl. There's still a lot of improvement there, but at least she knows uh, the command and she knows what to do. You just uh, need a, a little bit of polishing. I, I saw her do this um, several times, like without even having the treats. Um, so I just want to establish this as a command to her. I saw her stand actually. Stand up. Stand up. Yes. Good girl. So you see, since she's so into the tree, I just lured him to stand up. And once she was already in that position, I just say my marker word, which is yes, and then gave her the tree. That just gives her that notion that whenever she does that, whenever I say the, the word stand up, and she does that, she will get a tree. <laughs> okay, stand up. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Maybe I can try to get her to go into a down position. I'm not sure if she's gonna be able to do it in one try, but let's see. Yona? No, no, sit, sit. So I guess the, the technique here is to just have her sit first, so it's easier for her to go down. Let's just get her attention first. Sit. Good girl, down, sit, no, no, sit, down, down, yes, good, down. So you see, you just have to lure her to be, uh, to lie down on the floor. Come on, come on, sit, down, no, 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 sit, down, yes, good girl. I might probably not be clear and firm with my command, so I have to do that again and make sure that she just registers the right word and right tone. Yona, down. Yes, that was good. Down, good girl. Good girl. So once you've established it, you just have to keep repeating because 
in everything in life, you just have to keep practicing to make it perfect. All right, so I guess that would be it for now. So just to wrap up, okay, so a few tips in training your dog. Um, so establish your command, say it in a clear tone, have your treats, you have to lure them into the position where you want them to be in. Like, Yona, sit, sit, good girl. Then you, well, for that instance, I just say good girl, but she also knows that uh, marker. So it's either good girl or yes. Yes is easier because you can, you know, it's, it's quicker to say. Um, especially for those situations where it's really important for them to quickly um, hear that they've already done the, the right position, they're already in the right position. And then once you've said that marker, you have to give the treat to them. Yona, Yona, stand up, stand up, stand up. Oh, you have Sven here again. Stand up, yes, good girl. Okay guys, so that will be it. I hope you learned something. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you find this video helpful, and do you think that Sven and Yona are really cute? Then please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you in the next one. Bye.